right. Nuke Possum Springs. Nuke Possum sp Springs. Nuke Possum Springs just dropped. Oh. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I forgot that we stopped in the middle of a day. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I am in agreement. <laughs> So we hung out with uh, we hung out with Angus. So we have Greg and B left. What do we what do we think? Save save Greg for for last. Go. Yeah, go save to... save Greg for last. Okay. Yeah. It's time for bees. <laughs> bees nuts. Got him. Got him. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> like to thank God for this accomplishment. <laughs> I'd like to thank uh, Martin Van Buren for this accomplishment. <laughs> I'd like to thank capitalism. Martin Van Buren, who's Psych. been dead for at least five years, is responsible for this achievement. I thank at him minimum anyway. minimum five years. <laughs> at most <least>. five. <laughs> hey, B. Hey. <coughs> Uh, you all right? You seem down. May, have you not picked up that this is just Bee's life and she's always kind of sad? <laughs> oh, it's nothing. <laughs> Duh. Uh, you wanna talk about it? Nah. Nah, we'll just get <laughs> this much closer to actually punching you. Uh, okay. Ooh, what are you up to today? <laughs> Uh, uh, whatever you want to do. <laughs> whatever. Proximity. A valuable life lesson. So, uh, well, what kind of party is this? Um. Oh shit, it's the party! A Jackie party? <laughs> what's, a, what's a Jackie party? <laughs> You remember Jackie? Yeah, she hates me. Oh, that was years ago. Oh, yeah. no. <laughs> uh, does uh -oh. Jackie have, like, a one-woman band? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Trans World Order, give them hell. Twogth? Yeah, it's actually really great. She's got a great screen. I'm sold. Twog. Hey B, say it. Say twog. Twog. <laughs> twog. Twog. Anyway. Lord. <laughs> this is a party. And Jackie invited me. Look at you. I'm going to secret parties and shit. They're not secret, May. Well, I wasn't invited. Okay, I invite you. You are now invited. Woohoo! Okay, we got like a 90 minute drive ahead, so... Jeez, this better be some party. Jackie parties are worth the trip. Actually, an intervention. Uh, I think I went here once, in Girl Scouts, to see some sort of Longest Night play. Yeah, I was there. Oh yeah, we were kind of stuck together back then. Uh, what even was that play? Why, why'd you start talking to me? <laughs> what even was that play? Corbin the Thief. Old and kind of obscure. Sick, slick little barn cat. Sick and slick lived in the woods where no one could find him. But then he stole a diamond or something from like the local king and got arrowed to death. Oh, yeah, right. Mm, sick. What a way to go. There's a whole second part where he's a ghost. But they never performed that one, so. Hmm. Poor ghost cat. All right, let's go. Papa T's, pizza subs and beer. 
I, in that order. I'm kind of nervous about this. Stay close, all right? Nothing to be scared of down there. Just a party. Not too late to throw ourselves into traffic instead. Hey, Jackie! <laughs> Who wants Jackie. to be Jackie? Hey, B! Oh, weird. It's May. Hey, Jackie. You brought May. Yeah, is that okay? Sure. It'll be fun. Come on in. It's a good one. Is there, like, dancing and stuff? The world is ending, May. Of course, there's dancing. Good answer. Cool. <laughs> okay. I hope there's a dancing mini game. Isn't oh, that the goat that was at the what, bonfire? I think so. Yeah. That's why you gotta take it seriously. Put your foot down. No fascists at this party. Am I right? Ha ha ha, right. You don't talk this shit out. You punch that shit out. You yeah, duck the guy. Do you think that's best? Uh, yeah. Harry and I have to learn how to throw a punch. We can't have no sense of humor about this shit. Mace works too. Mace against fascists! <laughs> Literally. Hey. hey, this is May. Hey, May. Yep, that's May. Hey. So, where are you guys from? Suburban Bright Harbor. Couple of them born in Bright Harbor. Wow, what are you doing out here? Long story for the both of us. <laughs> I got time. Hold on, we're gonna go yell at DJ real quick. We know him. He's a total dink. Nope. Okay, I'll I'll be I'll be here. Bye, boys. Goodbye. <laughs> Fare thee well. Uh, you seem nice. This is very cool. No drinking, May. Okay, fine. You guys want to dance? Dancing mini game. Dancing mini game. <laughs> Can you dance, May? Can like anyone here dance? Y mm, fair enough. <laughs> See, they can't. Look at them. <laughs> They're, They're just fighting. bobbing and bending I've their heard, knees. I've, I've heard some just doing the teapot. Hmm. <laughs> Are we dancing? Oh. <laughs> oh. Hi. You gotta move. We're dancing. We're, groove. we're dancing. We're dancing. Feel the groove. Feel the sunshine. <laughs> Feel the groove the sunshine. Dance. 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 So we will fight the fascists with our groove. Or die trying. Hey, I think those guys are back over there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Should we go talk to them? Yeah, we should. I can dance. I never knew. I'm gonna keep dancing. Uh, are you sure? Yeah, I, I don't think I've ever danced at a party before. Okay, we'll be like 10 feet away. With an eye shot. Why do I feel like this is not going to go well? And I'll watch you. Don't drink anything someone gives you. Yeah, I know. No, seriously. If any... B, I'll be fine. Let's go! She'll be fine! Okay, okay, okay. 
dancing and grooving all night. <laughs> That's my favorite. This Whatever one, the fuck yeah. that is. Yeah, this one. <laughs> the, little, the little jig. <laughs> <laughs> Wobble, 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 Hey, mate. This is Chris. Hey, Chris. Hi. Your friend Marie is pretty cool. Ah, uh, she's okay. <laughs> oh, you're laughing a lot. <laughs> Evie, a truce. That's like an old name. Like a book you read in second grade. Well, uh... A book you like? <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Mm. Oh. Uh, uh, I, I used to be a big reader. Yeah, I got bored with books. My granddad used to read to me. Where we got to mention died. Jesus Christ, May. Ha! <laughs> sure about your granddad. He's okay. It was years ago. His mom is dead. Oh, no! Jesus, oh. May. Oh. Uh <laughs> May, May, stop. <laughs> sure, everyone here knows someone who died. My dog died last spring. <laughs> My house exploded. Oh. Oh. Because there was a gas leak. Holy Yikes. shit. From when my dad hit a line. Trying to dig up the dog we had before that. Literally, what the fuck? What? Because we were going to move. Oh. And Dad said he had to come with us. That's um. Weird. What the fuck? Oh, oh wow. <laughs> so Chris, what are you making right now? You're probably shy. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Are there a lot of jobs in that? I, I, I don't know. I just find it interesting. I feel like you have to be pretty materialistic. To go to college just so you can get a job. Uh, just so you can get a job after. Haha, uh, yeah, I don't know if he's gonna like that. Yikes! That's interesting because. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa. Check out Rich Kid over here. You gotta pay zillions of dollars to go to college just because something's interesting. BB, check this dude out. Jesus Christ. You ever worked a day in your life, Chaz? Oh, May, shut up. Please <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> I interned at my uncle's farm, yes. Well, I bag groceries. Okay. <laughs> it's a pretty cool name. Do you want to dance some more? Look at that little sister. Yes, <laughs> please. <laughs> nah, I'm good. Nah, sure. <laughs> you should go dance. We could dance if we want to. Yeah, my parents are on your own business, so. Ooh, okay, tell me, tell me about it. B, what do you see in this guy? <laughs> I, know, I know a bit about running a small business. Wanna go across the street and get some pizza? I could eat, and it's a small business. You'll speak their language, you get us free slices. What the uh, fuck does that mean? Oh! V doesn't like spoiled rich kids, Chuck. This is negative Riz right now. <laughs> oh, come along if that's okay, V. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> okay. Oh God, party! <laughs> oh, oh my lord! Gets worse and worse. Let me tell you about just Beatrice Santo. <laughs> she's not even drinking; she's just an asshole. Yeah, she she's really is asshole. like completely sober. Oh my God! Oh man, which option? First oh, one. Oh my God! I, I, 
May, I fucking hate you. <laughs> Why is Mina's May so spiteful? all about business. She's super on top of things. Super smart and responsible. She runs like go. the biggest store in Possum Springs. Oh, um, May. No. No, no. What even is Possum Springs? Hey, who actually in your mountains? While well, rich kid over here is studying politicians or whatever, V's out in the real world. Not like you college kids. Oh my god, May. Uh, go on. May! Shut the fuck up! You broke for real life. What? <laughs> kinda over the whole college thing myself. V and I basically run by some springs. Except there's like a ghost or something. You two live in Possum Springs? Yeah, I got a problem with that. Wow, you drove all the way here from New Powell County? This is like in Pennsylvania. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Isn't that like two hours away? No, I, um. I... Why would you do that? Hey, Rick! Be here, driving from Deep Hall! Are you not a student? Yeah. What? Yeah, I am. I'm. <laughs> oh, she just wants to fit in. She wants to have a party. Aww. Oh, oh May, you fucking bitch. <laughs> All right. To be fair, Chris was also like pompous, but May's just yeah. an asshole. <laughs> yeah. Yes. He... But also, I feel like <laughs> he was just trying to get some tail. Her. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> Oh, what a dunce. Yeah. On this. Enter her you. What was that about? I think she doesn't go here. <laughs> so? Dude, I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we can't go back and dance more. and fucked up. Goodbye, kids. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Sweetie. Hey, we can go dance some more. We can dance if we want to, now that we've ruined our friendships. Hey, what the fuck did you do? I was gonna ask the same thing. How in the world did you mess that up? She needs this. Now she's God knows where. If something happens to her, I will personally punch your teeth out. You got that? Hey, jeez. Alright, I'm gonna go up the street. You go down toward the river. We find her, make sure she's okay, and meet back here. Oh, oh, oh god, okay. Back in school, I always told me that you were an asshole. And I really thought that was true. And it's good to know I was right. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Where are you, B? The roofs. You can get to the river quick on the roofs. The roof. Hey, I'm the roof. Oh. What? What? Move that goth dorks. No. no. I need to get up on the roof. You are not jumping on my car. I will end you right here in this pizza place parking lot. You cool you down. You F off. Come on, Minaro. Don't tell me to cool down. Know. Get away from my damn car. It's a 1987 Bugatti. <laughs> if you don't get away from your damn car, I'm gonna run it over your damn head. Mate, what the fuck? Did you even drive? You're like 10. Wanna find out, citizen? I'm. Oh, sorry. Keep it. If you don't move right now, I'm going to probably make you eat this entire car. <laughs> I can do it. I'd like to think you try. The last oh, person really I heard, I'm, I'm pointing physically, at you. I heard him very, very badly. Physically. Jesus Christ. Seriously, I'm about to. So cringe. You're about to what? Wag my finger at you. You know what? I don't have time for this. I have no. to go drive my 1987 Bugatti elsewhere. No, you don't. Move. 
Hope you break your spine. Meanie. My car. My movie. fucking sucks. Yeah. yeah. Truth. Yeah, they definitely made a uh, a hateable protagonist, didn't they? Yeah. There's, there's a oh, the water slide. Yeah, it's a water slide. <laughs> Gonna We're... take a water oh, God, slide. Ruined my friend's life. Wee! Water slide. Very dark. Mm. I'm like, oh, I'm gonna take the roofs. And I immediately do not take the roofs. <laughs> immediately slip and just like crumple. Is kind of like really? a like, terminal montage crumple. <laughs> Oh, good thing cats always land on their feet. Mm -hmm. oh. Hey, there you are. Are you all right? Why did you run? It's like extremely dangerous. You're living in some college town and you don't even know what... This was my party. These are my parties. I come to these. So I can feel normal. We're like two hours a month. You could have been like mugged or something. All over some idiot guy. College is stupid anyway. Oh my god, you complete asshole. <laughs> you will never understand this. Ever. You know what I do when I go to sleep? <laughs> this is really freaking sad. I think, like, obsessively about going to college. Like, really, really think about it. And if I'm lucky, as I fall asleep, I dream about it. I have to dream about this. This thing you're so over already is, like, my wildest fantasy. Man, both of these are terrible options. Uh, you have a oh life. God. No, I don't. I have obligations. I have a routine. When my mom died, my life ended too. I had to take over the business because dad had a complete breakdown. And the bills for my mom literally dying were so bad that we lost the house. The house I grew up in. Gone. Some shitty family with their shitty kids live there now. Now we live in an apartment as my dad wastes away and like any idea I had of the future this big bright thing just gets smaller and darker. Every time I wake up from a dream about nights like tonight and you can't get that through your thick effing school. I had no idea about any of this. How? How could you not know this? I work hard. And I take care of what's left of my family. And my life is slipping away. And I'm trapped in that stupid hardware store. In that stupid town. I'm just doomed. You're not the only person stuck here, you know. You gave up the thing I can't have. I kind of hate you. I can't not hate you for that, a little. You don't know why I had to leave. Oh, I'm sure it's a brilliant reason. You just sit there judging me. Have you ever even asked why I left? Yeah. First day you were back. Oh. Right. So why did you leave? I... I don't know. Are you fucking kidding me? My head is in pieces right now. Any answer I could give would sound nuts. Oh. Well, that's illuminating. Oh, shut up. All this shit going on this past week, ghosts and shit. I met God. 
He was an asshole. Uh-huh. <sighs> Look. We're both trapped. Oh, we're trapped together. Better to be trapped with someone else, right? Mm. Listen, I'm sorry about, like... It's okay. We're, like, the best available friends. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> what river is this? Redwinder. All the iron in the water turns the rocks orange. Must be weird for them. All the rocks on land get to keep their colors. And the river rocks are always looking up at them. Hmm. So, like, actual question. Do you think we'd be friends if we weren't, like, stuck together in the same town? Like, we were stuck together in Girl Scouts? Like, uh, is this just... What's the word? Proximity? Yeah. I don't know. I honestly don't. My entire life feels like running after something. And that thing keeps moving away into the distance. While I stay in the same place. And I guess proximity counts for a lot right now. Hmm. Proximity. Do you want to go back to the party? No. You can come to another one sometime. So I'll, so I'll, I'll learn to talk good to, to whatever guy you're obviously trying to get with. Oh, good, thanks. You should have told me about everything. I was embarrassed. My entire life is embarrassing. Yeah, I am, like, more embarrassing than you will ever be. True. You're, like, stronger and smarter than anyone I've ever met. Thanks. And you're not as big a total idiot as I act like you are. I'm a jerk sometimes, I know that. But you're a genuinely good person? Huh? Good good is a is it's a it's a loose use of good. I'll take it. In this case it's relative. You know what the Fort Lucen fish fountain would say? <laughs> what? <laughs> Beatrice Santillo, we should get burgers and shakes on the way home. Oh wow, a revelation from God. The good God, the fake one. Okay. Let's go home. Home again, home again. Mayday that B. seems kind of like an abusive friendship. <laughs> Little bit. Stuck together, don't suck together. Uh. <clears throat> Crazy. Mm. Mayday is like just very clueless. Hi. Yeah. It's just a little self-centered. Yeah. It's the depression. <laughs> I wonder why she left college. Depression. That that could also be the reason. <laughs> Father. Ian, is that you? Son of Grey. Hello. <laughs> oh wow, are you okay? No. Okay. So what's going on? I don't think I can talk about it. We're gonna have to start talking sometime, kitten. I wish I could. Why can't you? Where do you even start? It's just... I've been having these dreams. And I keep thinking I see a ghost. A ghost? I've had these horrible nightmares that feel really real. I think something really bad is going to happen. And I've been running around doing all this stupid stuff. And where's it all going? What even is my life right now? I think I patched up some stuff tonight. Uh, did you? But like, everyone you is on their way somewhere else. <laughs> Yeah, I think you gaslit B into, like, accepting you as a person. 
Yeah. And I had that big fight with mom. Right. Kitten, it's okay. And, and, and. Shh, kitten. Take a breath. Okay, okay, okay. Why don't you get some sleep? Can I just stay down here for a bit? No. Sorry. Okay. Hang on. Okay. <laughs> as long as you like. I was just joking. Dad joke. I oh boy, it's Garboy and Malloy. Malloy. Ever think about, you know, the afterlife? <laughs> you know, God. You ever wonder why we're here, Garbo? <laughs> Who is Garbo? Oh, I don't remember. I don't have a life as it is! Thank you. Sorry. Why, Garbo? Do you think there's someone watching? Hey, I just hope anyone's watching at this time slot. <laughs> 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 These are big questions, Garbo! Don't get any bigger, Malloy. Shut the fuck up! Are you a church going, Garbo? <laughs> hey, the last time I was in church, they hadn't invented religion yet. <laughs> you were making it up as we went along. Okay, so we all think there's a god, right? We should have potlucks. Can't have a church without potlucks. You could, Malloy, but it would be. Tell us. A Wampa! <laughs> Thank you. Sweet comedy. <laughs> Coming up next, Garbo and I contact the dead! Uh-huh. Coming up next, Garbo and I meet God. <laughs> <laughs> Coming up next, Garbo and I make a suicide pact. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Oh no. A, a pregnancy pact. No, what? What? <laughs> Let Garbo. us name our children after each other. <laughs> it's Garbo, Garbo Malloys and, and Malloy Garboson. I wonder if the new working clock downstairs thinks this clock is scary. Big old thing upstairs like you, but different, huge, and spooky. Making Who weird noises you? at night. Uh, there's gotta be a fucking way to open this fucking safe. Uh, have you tried punching it? How deep is this house? Yes. Gotta be a way to open a safe. And like, I li I can't ask the parents Wait, 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 go back, go back, go back. It doesn't let you access numbers yet, right? Correct. Oh, I was gonna say, what if the cans are like a hint, but alas. <laughs> At first, even... I'm like, is, are these cans shaped in the form of loss? I'm like, no. Oh my lord. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no, really no, it's the children that must be wrong. <laughs> Am I out of touch? Yes. <laughs> is it in there? No. Hard to say. Oh, hey, Demon Town. In our hearts. Oh, hey, Big Zam. Oh, hey, Big Zam. <gasps> What's going on? Hey, you. Hey, me. B. I'm so tired from tonight. I bet. Did you run all the way to the river? Yeah, and the roots and stuff. That and dancing really take it out of you. That's like really gay. That's really nice, May. That you did that. Nah, it wasn't nothing. Go get some sleep. Okay, I'll do that. Thanks for running after me. Oh, I never go away. You'll never be rid of me. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> <laughs> Hard to I like her, please. Worst fates. 
kind of like herpes. <laughs> Takami today. Turn up founder Mike Eggplant to buy postal service. Oh no. What? Do huh. you all Wait, be did mailed he... eggplant? You discovered tur oh, never mind. That's the name of the company. Hey kid. Went to a party, danced at a party, ran around the rain. Wow, sounds like an awesome night. Here's a mixed bag. But all in all, I'd party again. We need to do more parties. You are very right. All right, I'm off to bed. Laters! Sure, cool. <laughs> sure, cool. Good, sure, cool. Yes. Yes, good, My sure. fa My favorite early 2000s band. Good, sure, cool. <laughs> Oh my god. I chime in with a. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Mr. Eggplant. I hear them crunching something. Wow, do we have a normal night's sleep? For once. Imagine. Angus, oh. Come pick your fight. You give arrows flight, you mess with week. me, you mess with all of us. Going to see the blank tones next week. Nice. Hey, kid. Snack, Falking. Work, work, work. Till I die, die, die. Maybe. Maybe. Be Beatrice. I summon. Hello, May. Pickaxe at it, me. You know the drill. Science beat. New research indicates that things don't necessarily have to be as bad as they are. Thanks, science. <laughs> science beat. There is no ethical consumption under capitalism. Thanks, science. Thanks, Sharkle. Capitalism is unethical. Sharkle. Sharkle. Jeez. Feels like it's been years since I got back and saw this again. Good morning. There's my little sunshine Daisy. Are you feeling any better from the other day? No, I'm feeling actually exponentially worse. <laughs> Sleeping a lot, a lot, but feeling oh. worse. Okay, well I'm gonna make you an appointment with Dr. Hank. Yeah, jeez, mom, it's fine. It is very much not fine, hon. I'm an adult, I can make that decision. When you're here, you're still my baby. When you're here? And I'm making you an appointment. <laughs> when you're here, you're baby. When you're here, you're Arby's. <laughs> I'm making you an appointment. My hun, I'm worried about you. I'm okay, mom. Okay, I'm gonna go. You sure you don't want to stay home and rest? Nah, I got stuff to do. What is it you have to do? I don't even know, honestly. Oh, hun. Please take it easy. I will not. Love you. Love you too. I can't go to a doctor. I got adult. things to do. Is there more talk? Literally every adult man. Mm -hmm. I keep the really good prescription headache meds on my nightstand. I can give you like half of one. Only half? Honey, you're... You know... Short. Half would be fine. It's fine, Mom. Okay, let me know if I can be any of help. Thanks, Mom. Goodbye now. Bye. Alright. Do we do we go for Oh. Oh god. What do you want? I 
hello to you, May. Well? I wanted to let you know. We ran a test on that arm you, you guys found a few days back. Oh, really? It's been drinking. <laughs> yeah, I thought you'd be interested at all. Definitely. An arm belonged to a middle-aged man. At medium build. And he was dead when it was removed. Whoa. That means... It doesn't mean anything yet. I just thought you'd like to know. You always liked detective stories as a kid. Okay, yeah, thanks. This ghost is seriously messed up. Ghost? There wasn't no ghost involved, whatever it was. Yeah, yeah, nobody believes me, I get it. Be careful, May. Strange stuff going on. I know! You're telling me! Have a Ranger nice evening, effect. May. What? Maybe. Maybe. Oh, no, don't you fucking. Hey, Selmers. Jeez, May, you sick? Nah, I mean, just tired, got a headache. Why are you running around? Because I am stubborn and defiant, and no sickness can keep me down. I'll get over Never it. Never gonna keep me down. Yeesh. Take it easy, neighbor. Can do. Wanna hear a new poem? Always. The stars, the stars. Like lights on cars. Going across the dark. And never start. It's true, they are like that. I got ready for longest night. Oh, I'm sorry, I got one ready for longest night. No. Oh. oh wait, it's not the poem, sorry. <laughs> longest night. Longest night. Night so dark. But stars so bright. Nice. Thanks, I'm feeling festive. You noticed anything, like, weird around here lately? Nope, just you. <laughs> weird as in... Ghost man. <laughs> Go ghost man. Uh, m missing kids? I don't think so. Not recently, at least. <sighs> that Casey killed last spring. But he weren't a kid no more. Maybe someone else, but from another town? I'm sure I'll remember. You know, I asked that, but didn't expect you to know. I read the paper. Forecasting the snow soon. When? Soon. Gonna get cold soon. That's it. That's all I got for you. I'm okay. Okay, boss. Uh, okay, boss. <laughs> Getting cold early this year. Don't bode well. Beware the cold serpents. They lie in sheep's. Oh wait, we gotta, we gotta. We gotta talk to, to, to Fisherman Magoo. What tunnel? Will tunnel fish always be there? Will tunnel drain? Can I be rare? I would miss the tunnel fish. To have them back would be my wish. Are you gonna drain the tunnel or something? No, it's poetry, okay? It's just making stuff up. Please don't listen. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> oh! You fucking suck. You Get a job. Suck. Get a job. It's not good to be such a snob. It's not good to be unemployed. <laughs> hmm. So, do we want to go to 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 Gregory? Gl I can get some Gleg. Some 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 Glunt. 
the Snalkin. Hey, man. Hey. How you holding up? Kind of splitting headache. Feel like I barely slept, even though I've slept a lot. Jeez, you okay? I don't know. Can I do anything? Uh, wait, uh, wait, wake me up somehow. Wake, wake me, me up. up. Ah! Can't wake whoa, up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wake up! Okay, I'm awake now. So what are you up to today? Uh, you want to check out that historical society? You sure? You seem like really tired. Yeah, let's do this. The Historical Society. This is where history is, uh, socialized. <laughs> Sorry we crashed. Yeah, it's okay. Is your bike okay? Yeah, I can fix it. I'm handy. It's too bad you didn't get run over. It's too bad you didn't crash into a train. It's too bad your corpse didn't get eaten by scavengers. It's too bad you didn't get eaten by scavengers alive. <laughs> so that's it, huh? Yep. Why are we doing this in the evening? Because it's cool. Because it's. I'm afraid of the. I'm afraid of the dark. Never been out here before. Me neither. Oh, I. Uh, I thought you had a plan. Who needs a plan? We're just breaking into an old house. Crime. Yep. We're breaking into an old house that gives public tours. It looks kind of, uh... Exactly like a haunted house? Yeah, like the, the, uh, like the, like the one in that, in that movie, that old movie, for Figure in the Hall. Uh, that title. Yeah, I know. Big old house. This place looks exactly like it. Well, you're looking for a ghost, right? I think it might be looking for me, actually. Oh yeah, the other night. Yeah. Well, whoever this is, maybe we'll get some info here. It's not like a person, dude. It's a ghost. Uh... Right. Well... Let's go find us a ghost. Time to get spooked! Oh god. You out, Greg? Hey, hey, where are you? That was fast. Over here! Man, I don't like this. Very not a fan of this. It'll be fine, probably. Aw, oh, yeah! Found the basement doors! We're going into the basement? Uh... <laughs> What? Stop yelling. Why are you talking like that? If you say th instead of th, it's harder. For someone, example, a ghost to hear that you're speaking. I have no idea what you're saying here. Okay, we're trying to be filthy, right? Oh, okay, I get what you're saying. Thank you. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> okay. We're fine. Nobody's here. Uh -huh. No lights on. Doors are locked. So how are we doing this? You are going to hold the flashlight. While I pick this lock. Oh, God. You can pick locks. I totally forgot. Yeah, dude. This is kind of awesome. It sure is. Crimes, dude. Crimes, dude. Hey, you want to shine that light down here? Cool, thanks. Mr. Mr. Spooky Ghost is going to be there the second I, I move the, the flashlight up again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, what was that? Mm, nothing. 
Uh huh. Hey, more light, please. May, please. May. <laughs> I can't work here. You're, 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 are you just fucking with me? No, I am not fucking with you, Greg. What the fuck? Okay, there. Oh, it's not me. Okay, there's something up there. Told you. All right, let me finish this. Also, watch my back. Basically, both. Hey, you! Up there! Oh, God. <laughs> ah, ah. It's an owl. Friggin? Owl. Are you okay? I think so. That was dangerous. I don't know, owls attacked like that. What was this effing deal? So we're in the basement. What are we actually looking for, by the way? The thing I read said sometimes when someone stays late, they hear weird things in something called the map room and in some off limits area. Technically, all of this is an off limits area right now. True, dude, true. Man, I dislike this a lot. <laughs> It'll be fine, probably. Dude, is that like two elevators? And not like old ones? Locked, too? Jeez, maybe this place is all elevators. Weird, why would it have two? One for the ghosts, one for the normies. Private rooftop ghost party. Play at the ghost pool. I hope you get squished by the elevator. I hope your head gets stuck in the door and gets chopped off. I hope you fall down the elevator shaft. I hope you get trapped in a dark elevator filled with water and an angry shark. Holy crap, dude. That's... Ugh. Okay. Here we go. Looks pretty empty. And dark. Hey, where's the flashlight? Crap. I left it outside. May. May, what? Drop the flashlight? Dude. You were being attacked by an owl. Alright. Well. I can see okay. Me too. Let's look around. Man. Closed for insurance purposes. Caution. Stairs not for climbing. These stairs are original to the house and are not functional at this time. What the hell are non-functioning stairs? So are we just supposed to, like... Levitate? Huh. Oh, check it out. Elevator number three? Looks like it's not locked either. Elevators for miles, dude. Yeah, this is weird. Are you gonna go? Are you gonna go? Why do I have to go first? It's your ghost! Okay, fine. Already in town. It's not even real. What? Dude, Uh-oh. What? 
the hell was that? I don't know. Is someone here? No. Lights off. Doors locked. No cars outside. Okay, so... Do you want to go back? Do you have your knife? Do you have your knife? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Wait, is the assumption that I'm gonna stab someone? Is that the plan now? No, I mean, just in case. I mean, the basement door locked behind us. Wait, what? Oh, right. Crap. I have to find another way out, too. Hold on, let me add that to the list. Map room, forbidden zone, find a way out. This is complicated. Crimes. Crimes. Oh, hey. Possum Massacre. Oh, nice! You remember this, right? Uh, sorta. Really cool, though. Just like the whole strike thing and how other people join them. Even when the boss is sending soldiers, they're like all united and like cannot give one you shit. Yeah, it's like the best history made, dude. Still makes me like proud and angry. Bosses are bad, dude. Bosses are bad. We are like, we're all supposed to look up to, like, bosses. Just in general. Like, even bad ones. Yeah, I refuse. Extremely ditto. Okay, well, like no music. nothing weird here. Educational, even. I feel like we're getting smarter. My brain is too huge as it is, dude. Gonna pop. That happens, I'm leaving your headless corpse here. <laughs> They'll be so freaked out in the morning. Nice. Oh, Ronald, I'm going to open this room for the day. <gasps> I say, this chap's brain appears to have to... Boost. Bring the mop, won't you, Ronald? Holy crap, is that elevator number four? How? Why? Granddad would be complaining about local tax dollars right now. Ugh. Ugh. That is not cool. Maybe it's like someone left a phone here and that's uh Probably that. Probably. Probably. Crimes. Crimes. Yeah, go going up. You're kidding me. Elevator number five. Hmm. Locked. I think this is as high as we're going without picking some locks, so... Ah, oh, crap. You're kidding me. Drop the lock pick stuff out back. You're kidding me. I was being attacked by an owl. Okay. Sorry. Can you, like, improvise? Um, need some pliers. You got a paperclip? Uh, no. Who's walk who walking around on Earth today is carrying a paperclip? Nobody. So, like, okay, do I... Just, just so I got this straight now. Shoot. Map room. Forbidden zone. Find a way out. Find pliers. Find paperclip. I think that's it. This is so stupid. This is like work. This is... This is all work. Did 
you hear that? Yeah. It did sound like a person. Yeah, I don't know what that was. Okay, well, let's hurry. We're gonna go right towards it, aren't we? Yep. What the heck? Oh, hey, it's my neighborhood. And the highway. No hand panther, though. Must be old. No, oh, wait. We're in the map room. Well, let's be extra careful, then. Okay. Crimes. Crimes. There's the graveyard. And the building we're in right now. Spooky. Like we're being watched. Please don't say that. Hey, it's my neighborhood. Wow, there's a tiny U in there, I bet. Oh, that's... Sorry, that like made me dizzy. I'm dangerous. Good old towny sentry. Town center, the center of our town. Quite. Uh, I think that's the old food donkey. And the woods you ghost guy ran into? Yep. He sure gets around for a dead guy. And he does. Ugh. Why did the why did that just turn on? Why is why is the house wearing red? Ooh. That creepy noise again. In this room. Yeah. What the fuck? Oh, it's an animatronic. Oh, it's alive. Jeez, that thing is ugly. Well, this was the source of the noise, I guess. Mystery solved. Wait. No. If this was making the noise, that means that someone was in here. Yeah. While we were walking around. Oh, shit. Yeah, maybe let's go. No, we have to find stuff. S oh, stuff. Dude, we're gonna get, like, tasered or something. By a big... Bulking, uh... Historical Society employee. <laughs> Whatever. I've been blaming you if this goes bad. Fine. Fine. I'm sorry, dude. Me too. I'd never turn you in. Me either. Crimes. Hey, check it out. Toolbox. Repair guy must have left for the night halfway through fixing him. I think some pliers. Oh, cool, 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 cool. I was thinking we'd never find them and just, like, starve in here. There will be people here in the morning. Oh, right. So, uh, we need a paper clip. I'm sure there's a paperclip somewhere in this place. They probably have, like, an office or something. Probably. With, like, nine elevators in it. Alright, so now we gotta go down twice, I think. <laughs> Going down. Swinging. 
other people go on weird ghost hunting adventures, and they're looking for, like, cool shit. Okay, well... Yeah, let's find a paperclip. Donut wolf receipt. Ride that chariot, Nancy. Big ass stapler. Picture of a dang hound dog. Right. Picture of some dang that? kids. One of those little hula girls. Found one. All right, so we got the stuff. Let's get the uh, that elevator open and see what's upstairs. I'm gonna guess it's like 12 more elevators. Going up, I guess. Going back, oh, I thought you were going back down. All right, we ready to go? Yeah, for sure. Gotta get to work. I'm gonna like break out of county jail someday with these skills. Dude, what are you going to jail for? Probably something like this, honestly. Uh, dude, you need to hurry. What? Someone's coming. They're in the hallway downstairs. Crap. Okay, I'll have it done in like. Oh, it's spooky ghost, isn't it? Oh god. Oh, dude. The elevator. Shit. Shit. Hurry. There, I got it. Go. Shit, are we in the basement? Oh, okay. Oh, hey, that's where the uh, that elevator goes? This elevator? Yeah, so... That doesn't make a lot of sense. Maybe, like, this elevator is for loading things for the map room, and, like, they use the other one to avoid the stairs, but even then... Dude, none of this makes sense! It doesn't look like whatever that is is following us down here. Whatever, not whoever? Whoever. Are you coming around on this ghost thing? Ghosts don't use elevators. Why, so a ghost can walk upstairs or something? The elevators are out of the question? So the question I have is... Where does that one go? Crimes? Crimes. Okay, just gotta pick this. In the dark. Jeez, sorry. It's cool light. Shit. I'm gonna keep picking. You see if we can get out through the back. so screwed. I'm working, I'm working! It's locked, something locked it. Someone. We can go back upstairs? Actually no, we're just gonna get chased around in a circle. By whatever it is. Whoever it is. Dude. And... Got it. We don't know where this is gonna go. Got any better ideas? Dude, clearly I don't. Oh, it's a spooky attic. They have an elevator that goes from the basement to the attic, with no stops in between. What the actual crap? Quick, let's find a way out. Yes, please. <laughs> I want out.
I found a window. I think there's a fire escape. Window doesn't open, though. Ugh. Window doesn't open. Whoa. Oh my god. What is this place? Forbidden zone. Are they starting like a weird art museum? This is bad art. This is weird. It's art, dude. What the? No, this is familiar. How do I know this? Shit, dude! The elevator! Why do I know this painting? Dude, come on! The elevator's coming back! Hurry! Oh, I'm hurrying. Ah! Greg, where did you go? The steps just ended. You gotta jump. Okay. Ow. You believe me now? I believe we almost got caught by a security guard or something. No, I'm telling you, I can like, feel it. Okay, fine. Ghost, ghost, security guard. Sorry about all this. You crashed your bike, got mauled by an owl, broke through a window, and jumped off a fire escape. Nah, dude, it wasn't nothing. You're a really good friend, Greg. Psh. Crimes. Crimes. This is my coping mechanism. Uh, what? <laughs> what? What? Dude, what's wrong? Dude, talk to me! Jeez, uh, my head. We need to talk to everyone t tonight. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Can you get on the bike? I think so. Okay, grab onto me and I'll get us home quick. What about the ghost? Ain't no ghosts here! Let's go. Thanks for, like, coming. Again, we live here. <laughs> yeah, you're in my living room. Sam. Beatrice. Beatrice. Beatrice Antello. Um, Sorry, I'm, I was muted. Oh. Uh, oh. I don't things. So, like, do you have, like, an idea of what's going on? Uh, there, there's a ghost that's in my head. Like, the night after I saw the kidnapping. Or I think it was a kidnapping. I had this dream I barely remember except for this sound. This horrible sound. And this feeling, I keep hearing it whenever the ghost gets nearby. It's like someone rips open a hole in my brain. You know, I know you guys don't believe me. It's not that I don't believe you, that something's happening with you. I just don't know that it's a ghost. Yeah, dude. There are, like, 50 better explanations for all of this. Like what? 
you have like sudden stress mig migraines and you saw something that freaked you out and makes you stress out. On goose. I get migraines. And mate, you've got you've gone through a lot of life changes recently. And I don't know, stress does weird things to people. Okay, fine, fine, whatever. I'm going up into the woods. I know this thing is up there. I know what I saw, and if you don't believe me, that's fine. I'll go alone. You're really gonna hike up past the basketball court? It's late, dude. Why do you all care? You don't believe me anyway. Angles. I'll go. <gasps> Listen, I don't believe in ghosts, but I believe in you. Ah, oh, dude. So let's go find your ghost. I was fixing to say something like that. But you said it better. Aw, you guys. It's not even ghost hunting season. Yeah, it's buck. We're outlaws. Th thank you for believing me. Mostly, I just don't want you wandering around up there alone. At night. Close enough. Alright. Let's hunt some ghosts. Haven't been on a night hike in a long time. Gotta listen for owls. Why? No reason. Alright. I got work in the morning. Let's go catch us a ghost. Bad art, no clues, chased by ghost. Greg rules, okay. up here. Fences work. Nah, people are up here all the time. I came here when I was like six. What's up here? Just old junk and trees and animals. What is a bee? Nothing. Nothing. I was praying. Wow. Really? Yeah, let's go. Into the woods. Wait. What? I think I heard an owl. Oh, God. I got attacked by an owl bee. What when? Uh, when we were breaking into that history place. I don't think they attack groups, bug. Well, if I get mauled to death, I warned you all. I'll punch any owl that gets near you. Everyone needs to find themselves in Angus. Ah, thanks, Captain. Captain and Bug. 
big, dangerous Greg. Scared of birds. I almost died from that owl. stuff somewhere, I guess. You remember this from when you were 12, Greg? Yeah, I was scared of it. How'd they even get all this back up in here? Yeah. What's up? Nothing. Just like all this old, old stuff out here. It's here every night. When you go to sleep. So? It's out here, in the, in the dark. So old. So old, so old, so old. <clears throat> uh, dude! Hey, May! I'm fine. We should go back. This is stupid. No, it's fine. Ghost hunt. Woo, fun. None of, none of us thought to bring a flashlight. Oh, well, we, we lost, lost it. it. Like nobody else. What the... Huh? Oh my god. No! No! Ah, oh, hell. He's awake already. Anyone got any juice? No, no, guys. Ah, oh, hell. Guys, guys, wait! Lord, if you knew this was gonna happen. You knew it the moment you screwed this whole thing up. It ain't like you weren't on the other side of this before. It was a mistake. I owned up to it. Lord, this is you owning up to it. Aren't I allowed to make one mistake? One mistake? You left a goddamn arm in front of the click clack. <laughs> because of you, God knows what's gonna happen in this town. What was I supposed to do? <sighs> it was your screw up. Ugh, his legs stuck. And it wasn't like you couldn't have called any of us. I panicked, okay? I was embarrassed! Sure wish you'd call me, Larv. You think any of us want to do this? Guys, we can figure something out. Nothing to figure out! B -b but I got family! Larv, don't insult us. You know you don't want, gotta worry about Jeannie and the girls. They'll be completely taken care of. They'll never want for nothing. He's not gonna budge with that leg sticking straight out. Ah, oh, hell. Dave, Rick, <laughs> Benny, you guys know me! Alright, Dave, you hold him. I'm sorry, Lerv. You know we got no choice. And I'd appreciate if you'd stop laying a guilt trip on us. No, no, no! Hold him still. No! Ah! Hold still, this will go easier for <laughs> All right, he's 
is free. Flurve. <laughs> Flurve. Ain't no one can hear you this far out. You're just putting yourself to more anguish. And... <laughs> <gasps> Hell, let's get this over with. Would you just make this easy, Lurf? Oh, God, his bone's sticking out. <gasps> the hell? The hell? Shit. May? May Borowski? <laughs> Angus. Oh. Oh, goodbye. Run! What the hell is going on? Oh, my lord. Jesus. Huh. Part four. The end of everything. Nice. Derm. Oh wait, who is there? I think that was Ian. Ian just said the word yep. Yep, yep. <laughs> I barely remember how to play this. It's like riding a bike. I play this game in my head when I'm falling asleep. Hmm. I like to go for the plots of books I've read. Oh, look at this smarty. I try to remember every place I've been. In order. <laughs> oh. Wow. Alright, Will. Oh, I'm controlling B. I don't see anyone out there. Just wait, he'll be back. So we still have him down. Oh, <laughs> this is this is B now. So we still have no idea who this is. Uh, big guy, dirty coat. Uh, or several, they could swap out. I, I can't tell. Okay, so got brownies, sodas, uh, lots of brownies. I'm making brownies, and. Yeah. Maybe lasagna. Lasagna? I, I already found one in the freezer. Why all the food? Need to eat. Everyone needs to eat. Are you like scared and worried? Good dinner makes everyone feel better. <laughs> okay. Someone's gotta take care of you. Thanks, Angus. You're extremely good. Extremely good. Well, I'd know more than anyone else. Incorrect. 
So that guy you saw in the woods in Possum Jump? Yup. Were those guys like that guy? Yep, sorta. Of. He had a hat. Hmm. I need you to frost the lasagna. What do I do? You cook it frozen? Uh. <laughs> Getting darker earlier. So, no word from her parents? Nope. bad, right? Yep. Here. Thanks, guys. This game had a great soundtrack. Very high school summer. I listened to, like, half the bands is on it. We're gonna see the blank tones in a few days. Or if we were. I don't know. Sure. Hey, that's me. I'm sure I'm I played this until I broke one of the sticks. That's harsh. <laughs> I don't screw around. <laughs> That's the spirit. I am so tired. I could like curl up on their bed. There's like a whole living area under there. I think it's a bad situation. Yep. Yup. Yeah. Wait, everybody shut up. Is B smoking in the apartment? Yeah. Yep. What? I heard it too. Seriously, what? There's someone standing outside the door. Oh my god. What? Everybody be very quiet. Everybody! Be quiet! Panic! Oh my god. Oh, cutscene time? Uh, to close out all the alcohol in my face. Trudging. Oh, we're trudging. Oh, we're falling. <laughs> That's no good. Who 
was oh who was the the church lady I don't remember yeah I don't remember either uh is May just taking a snooze on the feet? <laughs> yup. Alright, I'm um, take it. Sorry In this room? I believe that. Times like this, we can call out. And know that our cries are heard. Here, maybe someone would like to say something about May. That'd be nice. May is a good girl. She and I explored the stars, and and she loved to hear about them. She. I'm sorry. Be difficult. Uh, anyone else? I've always known May's kid down the street. A little younger than me, but tough. I've been through it in the past couple of years. Addiction, jail, rehab, divorce. Wow, holy shit, Summers. And I just think it's not fair. I may have all people should have trouble. Where's the god in that? Where's the higher power? This is all a bunch of bullshit. Thank you so much. <laughs> Anyone else? Who's the get off my long guy? I'll say something. <laughs> May Baranski's always <laughs> been a menace. And I called the police on her more than once. I hope she wakes up and learns a lesson. May's mom just smacks him into next week. <laughs> That's all I got to say. Father Ian. Uh, okay. Thank you, William. Uh, I'll speak up. Go ahead. May it was a daughter to all of us on the block. Mike, Mike. Oh, speak for yourself. Sometimes folks in the wrong place at the wrong time. I hope we find out what exactly happened to her. Oh, we know. Her friends told us. Father Ian. Father Ian. Ian Papa. Please. Sorry. Oh, jeez. I was going to clean my glasses. Yeah, the, they were out in the woods at night. Down the end of Central Ave. And someone was out there hunting illegally. And they got shot at. And May fell and... She must have fallen off a million things a million times. All it takes is landing the wrong way one time, man. Oh. Well. I hope she wakes up soon and tells us all about it. Bro, what the fuck? See if she remembers who done it. I'm sure she oh. Sure she... Is you. Aww. Oh. 
Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt. What's happened to this one? Do we know you? Are you here to clean up? Nah. Supposed to be fixing a door. I'm here. Nope. Okay, so... He's gonna be fine. For today, leastways. What? What? Who are you? Janitor. Mm-hmm. Our house is gone. Mm, hey! Oh, thank God. What did you say, Meg? It's dead. What's well, dead, honey? May, honey? Everything. She lives. She just walked out of her house. Yep. It's me. It's me. You came back to life? I don't think she was dead. Pizza party! I'm feeling woozy. You should lay down. You can sleep in our bed. I feel weird about that. How about the couch? Do I have to stop playing? No, Same term. good. Okay. Well, I'm getting good progress. <laughs> Her mom said I appreciate the sound. Okay. The sound effects. Please keep that ASMR going. Okay, good. Should have rolled. Mm -hmm. Late amateur didn't know to roll. <laughs> so she just like wandered out of her house. Man, all the way here. Jeez. Lucky she didn't pass out somewhere out there. I sure hope she's all right. Hey, hey, hey. Both of you, shush. No. What? It's less noisy. <laughs> How well do you know this guy? We order pizza, what, twice a week? At least. From out by the highway now that Pasta Billy's is closed down. I thought you two were trying to save money. What? Don't police our lifestyle, B. Okay, well, just as long as you're sure the delivery guy is safe. I could spot him through the keyhole. If it's not him, we'll turn off the light. And I guess hide in here until we die. Alright, well, as long as there's a plan. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hello. Look who's awake. Uh, it's him. It's the pizza guy. 
Pizza's here. What? So what, oh, what happened? Oh. We called the cops. Your aunt and some guy fished you out of the woods. You were like in a coma. Did you die? I just took a very long nap. Nice. Uh, yeah, nice. Chris. You didn't finish it. I had this dream, or like a vision, or I time travel. I don't know. I'm like in and out of consciousness. Can you not eat? You should eat. I don't know if I can. Sorry, Mom. You scared us to death, honey. Sorry, Mom. We'll come pick you up. No, it's cool. I'm just gonna sleep here. B is there? B is here. Okay. I'll be back I'll... in the morning. Have B drive you home. I will. May. I know. Give us a call if you need to come home. I will. Love you, Mom. I love you, sweetie. Sorry, buddy. You want a brody? I can't really eat right now. Like, I puke, but there isn't anything in there. So I'd like puke my actual guts out. Oh, right. You need your guts. Eh, for the moment, at least. Dude, wild week, huh? Who could say that? When we get out of this... I don't know if we're getting out of this. Well, even if we don't, and we're ghosts, we should hang out more. Deal. You there. What even was that game? Werewolf Shred the Gnar 3. Now, I played this at Casey's house, like, years ago. I played it yesterday. At home. Cool. They've got Wi-Fi. Nice. Like we're a uh, real place. At least within range. I don't even have a phone because of this place. It's the 1800s here. Hey, man. Yeah. I'm really glad you're not dead. Me too. Yeah. 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 Yeah, uh, like, yeah, can we all hit the sack? Cool, I'll be right out. Hey, kids, can we do lights out now? I'm gonna drop over. Yeah, dude. Sounds good. See you all tomorrow. I'm sure it's safe for you to leave. None of this got anything to do with me. No weirdos are following me around. Oh, right. I'm a freeps man. See ya. Goodbye, Jerm. Don't call me that. <laughs> do you know why I 
beat down Andy Cullen six years ago. No. We weren't talking then, and I thought it'd be weird to bring it up now, and... When I was playing this video game, you were, like, dating ghosts or something. Okay. I was really into it, played it, like, 24-7, until this one afternoon, and suddenly, like, something broke. Broke? It was just, like, pixels. The characters on screen, I felt like I knew them. They weren't people anymore, they were just shapes. And the lines were just things someone had written. They never existed, they never had feelings. They never would exist either. I felt so sad, like I just lost these real people. This whole thing we had, it was just me alone. And like that realization, like, dumped out of the screen and into real life. Went outside in the tree out front. I looked at it every day, it was like a friend outside of the window. Now it was just a thing, just a thing that was there. Growing and eating and just being there. Like all the stuff I felt about the tree was just in my head. There was some guy walking by, and it was just shapes, just like this moving bulk of stuff, and I cried. Because nothing was there for me anymore. It was all just stuff, stuff in the universe, just dead. Wow, that's... Um... The next day was that softball game, and Andy was the pitcher when I was up. And it was just shapes too, just lines someone wrote, like nothing in there, and... I was so scared and angry and I and just, I don't know, before I knew it I was on top of him smashing his face in with the bat, just shapes, red shapes all over the grass. Oh my god, May. Have you talked to anyone about this? After it happened they made me go to therapy with Dr. Hank. Oh god, he's the worst. And he made me start a journal. A journal? He kind of just said it would help to be able to get my thoughts down. Did it help? Kind of, sort of. But since this whole thing happened, when I'm alone in a new place, it's all shapes like back at the softball game. I was doing fine at college for a while, but I couldn't make friends. I was just afraid of being outside or around people alone. And there was this statue of like the founder or something. Really shitty statue, like all rusty metal, and it was it was these shapes, and it was pointing down at me, and I was so scared. I didn't leave my dorm. I either didn't eat or I ate entire pizzas at once. I downed cough syrup just to sleep all the time, and finally I got up the courage to leave, and I came home where everything was fine, where I knew everyone. It was it wasn't just dead shapes watching me. Jeez. Something broke in my head, in my life. I don't mean to be like, whatever, but it sounds like you're suffering from serious stuff. I'm like, I can I help you find some help for it? Dr. Hank already tried. I think Dr. Hank should stick to family dentistry, medicine and dentistry. And the half dozen other things he does. And maybe leave the mental health services to someone else. Like, there are things as there are such things as depression, anxiety, and like I don't know what you're going through. It exists. I I thought when I came home I just I felt so safe here and everything made sense for a few days and then all this and 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 It's gonna be okay. We'll figure this out. I'm so scared. I know. We're all scared. But we're gonna make it. You should get some sleep. I... Bye, guys. Love you. The hole in the center of everything. Oh, why is she going back? Bro, what?
What are you? You actually a ghost? Or just some guy? What is this thing in my head? Are you doing this? Why, why is this happening to me? Talk! Fine, let's do this. Hello? What the fuck? <laughs> Boom! Holy shit! Get away from her, you piece of shit. You're outnumbered, asshole. Ah, uh, you shot me. We can all use both of our arms. I will personally disassemble you. Wow, jeez, B. I... <laughs> you okay? What? What? What are? You're such an idiot. What were you thinking coming out here alone? I, uh, I had. This is all because of me. Well, I'm sorry. Are you the one putting on a dumb costume and following me around and kidnapping people? Maybe. Is that your fault now? He, it, it's in my dreams. Hey, kiddo, we're out here, outside your head. Whatever's going on in there, I believe you, but I'm not going to let you wander off into the woods to die. D no, no, but... Oh, shut up. Would you let me do this? Oh, that's cheating, putting it that way. We're all in this now. And even if we weren't... I'd still out be out here with you. Me too, obviously. Clearly. Clearly we all would be. Listen, I'm all the family my dad has left. I am for sh damn sure am not dying out here. And you're... God, you're the closest thing I have to a sister. I don't want you to be gone. Man. So you're not dying either. <coughs> that sounds okay. By me. Well, he's wounded. Sounded like he went back up to the mine. Yeah, what do we do? Follow him, I guess. Really? You all wait here. I'll, I'll go. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, anyway. If he's up in the mine, we might be able to corner him in. Tie him up? Or something. Can you walk me? I... I, I think so. Might be a little slow. I'll help you if you need it. Thanks, big guy. Alright, let's go do something really stupid. Gates open. Oh, jeez. What? You could, like, lock it shut or something? Ah, dang. You're right. No. He, uh, he, it, whatever. It, it's in there. I have to go down there. Well then. Looks like all of his friends are gone. Just one guy. Just one guy. Just one something. Bang, bang! Why does nobody have flashlights? Well, this isn't dangerous or anything. <laughs> 
Nothing to be scared of down here. Just a party. <laughs> Not too late to throw ourselves into traffic instead. Looks like you took the elevator down. So much for the element of surprise. It's gonna hear us coming a mile away. We sure we wanna do this? Yeah, May, you sure? Guys, I don't know if you understand. <coughs> He's in my head. I can't function like this. Everything is dying or dead already. I I don't know what's gonna happen down there. Okay, then. We'll come out of this together. Ooh, that thing looks old. We haven't used this mine in, like, a lot of years. Generations, even. Are you our tour guide now? Yo, fuck off. <laughs> I like history. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> we have Possum Springs tour brothers and tourism pamphlets at the shop. And I get poor. This is in the brochure. Well, here we are. <coughs> hey, you okay? I have my inhaler. No, I'm fine. It's just like... It's like something huge is on top of me. I mean, technically you're not wrong. Is it like asthma? <laughs> That's how asthma is. It's not asthma, big guy. But thanks. something down there gonna be okay May? yeah I'm all right you should be quiet yeah I'll save up for the screaming later <laughs> Whatever. Here we go. Ah, jeez. What is this place? Looks like a church or something. And, like, junk. Oh god, oh god. What is it? It's here. It's here, oh god. What is? I don't know, but it's here. It's through there. here say something what? 
Well, how about this? Take a couple more steps forward if you want to die. Show yourself. Yeah, asshole. We're like five times scarier than <laughs> you. Oh. There they are. They're right there. I'm gonna kill them. I didn't know it. It's out of your hands now. Me? Shoot me! And I say we're evil. A little girl got shot at the other night. Yeah, sorry about that. You're apologizing? It was a bad call, I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay. Didn't actually hit me, so... Wait, what the- who are you? Bunch of old boys doing their dance. To protect their own and the neighbor. To unite all peoples within our nation. Then why <laughs> are you trying to kill me? Kill you? Nobody's gonna kill you. All of you are part of this town. A family relation, or just by being hard work. Contributors. I'm okay. So we could just leave? Well, he brought you down here for us. And he's not gonna let you leave until he's had his game. Well, he's already got an arrow through the shoulder. I don't think he's gonna have be having much say in whatever. Wait, so you think that I... He kidnapped that kid at Harfest. He's been in my head somehow. I'm always tired, constant headaches. He's been following me. Following all of us. He... Oh, little girl. You don't know what this is, do you? What? Oh, God. I've seen this. Or I've... i felt it. Well, I say Scooter and Jim Dorney. Oh. <laughs> well, that's Scooter and Jim Dorney found it. 20 years back or so. After the West Mine closed out past Brittle. Best Schumacher, last supervisor, was out there when the company locked off the engine. Carver's initials and date in the door. Then you got this mine, the old one. Not even a proper mine. Big old. Copper. Abandoned. Shoot. Long before any of us were born. Too close to water. And that water was poison. When the first settlers came out here, that old spring used to be right above where we but the water dried up. In 1992, some, some, some mess, some men from the West Mine come back up here to drive bootleg. Practically built a new elevator, got the main tunnel clear. Never found no coal. Just dug deeper and deeper. So that bust through that wall and finds this. And Jim walks right into that hole and never hits bottom. Ed calls down to Jim. Jim, don't answer. But someone else does. I know you heard that voice go. In dreams and in waking time. Which what brought you down here. What? What? So what does this have to do with you or me or anyone? You got to understand. In those days, it was the end of the world. Job's gone. Kids leaving. Government didn't care. Only one on board. Just putting in more regulations. Sending our jobs over. Spending our taxes and lazy people and immigrants. While we worked ourselves. Ugh, here we go. God damn, I hate this crap. You old dipshits. You finished? Yeah, sure. We prayed and prayed up at the church. But when I and Scudder came back down here and listened, 
He got answers. Oh god, I think I know. Yeah, he's already in there singing to you, right? I... I... I had explained it to a few folks, and they didn't believe it. But he was persuasive. He had the glimmer. The glimmer? Once he takes a shine into it. It rubs off on you. You can do things. I never see it. They said Ed could walk through walls. Okay. After Ed talked us into all this, after that first time, after we picked one out, well, not only was the town hauled stable, but it was almost like we were getting younger, and money came too. Still a few of us left them back. First time? First one went into the hole by our own hand. We aren't up to what we do. I was there. I was too. You throw them in the hole? They're feeding him. He's hungry like you wouldn't believe. Every few minutes of story he starts singing. And it's someone's turn to find someone. What you were doing the other night? No. What happened the other night was a shame. One of our number broke the rule and had to pay up. That was a hard thing to do. I think I'm gonna be sick. We never pick no one who's gonna be missed. That's a solid rule. Drifters, drunks, and delinquents. You've been. Oh god, oh no. How many people? Casey? The other kid? All he was gonna contribute to society. Except a bunch of kids growing up with no dad. Was a rap sheet a mile long. Before whatever sad end he wind up at. We did him a favor. You killed? Casey? Oh my god. We don't use that wood. You know, he was taking up business with his cousin, right? You know what happened to his cousin? Burned alive when his little trailer had exploded. They had to wear hazmat suits when they cleaned him up. That's where Casey was in. You killed Casey. And you want to act like we didn't do him and this not a favor? Oh god, Casey's been down here the whole time. His parents put up posters. Maybe we should have cared more about him before it came to <gasps> Which one of you did it? Frag. He was my friend! Alright, now go down here or I will shoot. What if I get you first? Don't say that. <laughs> Bolt sticking right out of your eye. Bang. Bang. You brought guns down here? Dangerous this far out in the woods at night. Makes it safety. I... I... Throw it down, son. Don't make this our time. Monsters. None of this. None of this is happening. We are not monsters. We do it because we love our home. As long as we keep doing it. Possum Springs survived. Things can get better. These mines are going to be humming again someday. Old Mills puffing smoke. You kids don't understand that. We lost what our world was built around. Used to be provided for a family, 
Are you sweet when you provided for a house? Now you're stocking shelves at the grocery store. Kids leaving more than the same. No opportunity here. Old people dying. Houses left empty. You ever seen that? A home become a tumbled in pile of wood and plaster? A job become a burnt out brick box or a hole in the ground? We can change that. We can put this place back to where it won't be just shapes. I'm going to die down here. Why are you telling us all this? Because we're getting old. And even with the fringe benefit of good health, we need new blood. Carry this on, the little god. Really? You're like pitching us on this? Were any of you even miners back in the day? Any of you hurting now financially? Like, or is this just some big costume party murder club for someone's shitty boss who's afraid of dying? That don't matter. It does? This is real bad. This is insane. Why shouldn't we just call the cops? And see what? You saw some men you can't identify. In an abandoned mine behind the gate. And an elevator that won't run? That you saw a hole? Okay, fine. Why should we help you? Because if no one's here to do this. You remember that flood a few years back? You remember the blizzard of 2010? That's what happened. And beyond that, the jobs never come back, the kids never come back. Everything crumbles. Possum Springs bleeds to And soon we'll all be dead. And this town will just be fields and trees. I've seen it. I know you have. I understand if you need some time to think it over. So we can leave. No one's gonna stop you. But understand that you don't know who we are. Out there. But we know who you are. To be fair, they get to leave and I probably got permanent damage. Shut it, died. You don't know a thing about what he wants, what he is. I, I swear to God. Let's go. Yes, let's seriously get out of here. Son, you leave that crossbow. What? Why? Well, I can bullshit you. But the truth is, I just don't trust you. Fine, whatever. It's a piece of shit anyway. Kick it in the hole. <laughs> I, I can't move you guys. We'll carry you. I have no idea what to even think about any of this. It's just horror. It's not a word you get to use too often. That's all I've got left. Like, everything else in my head is gone. Let's get out of here fast. I don't know if I... Shh. Talk later. Old... Old stuff in here. Okay, I'm gonna have to put you down for a sec, okay? Okay. So, Casey. Yeah. I... Yeah. 
For what? I, I think I get it. Whoa, really? Too tired to explain it right, but, like, they lost what they thought was gonna happen, which was what had happened, like, a long time ago, or how they remember her, like, you picture it, and things it gave them, and so Casey and that kid at Harfest, and... Sorry, I lost it. Well, it's more sense than I can make of it. They're sad. It's all really sad. You ready to go again, Angus? Yep, sorry. Wait, everybody, shut up. What? Shh, I thought I... Ah! <gasps> what the fuck? Kick. Kick. In real time. Christ. What the fuck? Ooh. That was horrifying. But that happened. Dastardly, even. Holy shit! Is everyone okay? May, May, are you okay? May, say something. <laughs> May? <laughs> okay. It's okay, I've got you. You've gone now. Shit, how are we gonna get out of here? Shh, for a minute. We feel air coming in from somewhere. So we're not gonna suffocate. Okay, well that's a relief. How do you... I was a scout, Greg. I was a scout. Hey, I guess... Yeah. I love you. Aww. Oh, that's so gay. Welcome back, May. You okay? Better now that I almost got murdered. Again. Which is... weird. <laughs> that was like the third time in two days. <laughs> third time's the charm. Guys, the air is coming from back here. Alright, I'm up. You sure? Yeah, I think I can walk at least. It was boarded up a long time ago. Can we get through? Let's find out. Let's get out of here. Grab. Yep, that's some fresh air, all right. And water. Dude, that's amazing. You can smell water? Hopefully it's not a river. Cave rivers are death traps. <laughs> mine river. We're in a mine! Right. I can see the bottom. I don't think we're gonna die in the one foot of water. Right. Why isn't anyone following? Where is everybody? Ah. Oh. I know 
what you are now. I think I knew before, but, you know, after I sent that kid to the hospital years ago, I said I had an anger problem, but that's not true. I was angry because of something else, something I'd lost. Just trying so hard since not to be angry. Got me all defenseless. And I lost more and more and more. That's not getting better. I want to be angry. When I ran home from college, on the bus I had this dream. Or maybe I saw it out the window. Last leaf on the tree. Finally blown off. I'm so scared. All the time. And the fear hurts. Feeling like everything is over. It was over long before I got here. So long hiding. Or trying to outrun this. I get it. This won't stop until I die. But when I die, I want it to hurt. When my friends leave. When I have to let go. When this entire town is wiped off the map. I want it to hurt bad. I want to lose. I want to get beaten up. I want to hold on until I'm thrown off. And everything ends. And you know what? Until that happens, I want to hope again. And I want it to hurt. Because that means it meant something. It means I am something, at least. <laughs> Pretty amazing to be something, at least. No, I can't understand you, right? Oh, shut up already. I know this won't save me in the end. But I don't need it to save me forever. I just need it to save me now. So if you're gonna kill me right here, then do it. If not... Game over, that's it. Learn! Dude, you okay? Whoa. You got all sleepwalky there for a sec. You want me to carry you? No, I think I'm good. I'm just... very... very tired. Hang on here for a bit if you need to. We're safe. Uh-huh. Hey, there's light over here. Did you smell that? I bet he did. What is this? Might be a vent or something. Keep the miners from suffocating way back then. Looks old enough at least. For sure. Hello! <laughs> We're down here! Don't ask us why, please! Could get lucky and someone's out here in the woods at night. I... I can try to make it out. No, no, I can like... Okay, yeah, are you up for this? Yeah... I don't know. I'm, I'm like all hyper now. Like dolphins. <laughs> hyper like dolphins? No, like when your body is like, uh, whoa, I almost died. And you get all hyper because you're filled with dolphins. Endorphins. Okay, I'm seriously confused. Are you okay? Me? Endorphins. <laughs> ah. You okay? Yeah. Checks out. There, thank you. Those. Okay, well. Ride those dolphins up out of here. Uh, mm -hmm. That's assuming I can even do this. We'll watch. Okay. Oh, I see.
This place. Huh. You! Germ! Hey, May. Germ? Yeah. What the fuck are you doing out here? This is my, uh, my evening constitutional. I live <laughs> on the hill. I heard Greg yelling. We're all stuck down there. Yeah, you are at the bottom of the old well in my backyard. It's been a really bad night. Sounds like it. Got any rope or something? Yeah, right here in my hat. Uh, uh, can you go get it? It's in my... okay. <laughs> B. B. Hey, May! Yeah. What's that? Germ? Yeah, he's getting some rope. What is he doing out here? He lives here. In the woods? In the woods! In the woods! <laughs> My entire body hurts. That was a long way. I brought some sodas. You're the best germ. You need the sugar and caffeine. Not one without the other. No, uh, anyone else want to get far away from this well? Yep. Germ, can you, like, I don't know, seal up this well? Hmm. Yeah, okay. I got dynamite. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Hey, could you open the safe in my house? Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, I mean, I can get some. How big an explosion is that? I mean, not small. Okay, that works. E. Thanks, Germ. Yeah, thanks, buddy. Um, uh, okay. Bye, guys. What a bunch of funny... Guys. What a bunch of dorks. <laughs> there goes a weird, weird guy. He saved our lives. German's good. German's a good man. strikes me that we just murdered all those dudes down there. Hey, figure. Well, I mean, the elevator is broken, and we caused a cave-in. Now that was self-defense. I guess, but we did cause the death of, like, a dozen guys. No, 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 no. They're, they're all still alive down there. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Well, we're blameless. They attacked us. One of them attacked us. So we're worrying about, like... It's morally gray. We're not murderers. <laughs> like, if we, if we had a choice, we wouldn't have done it. I would have. <laughs> Angus! Thank Let's God. go. Hell yeah, Angus. Cold-blooded murder, Angus. Uh... What? They, 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 like, killed people. They were trying oh, man, to get us to kill you. people. Screw them. I don't even believe in hell, and I hope they all go straight there. Jeez, Angus. That's what I think, at least. Mm, this is like that trolley thing. <laughs> what trolley thing? Okay, I'll explain it if we keep walking. <laughs> Hey guys, uh, are you there? A anyone? Okay, I'm gonna type away. Hard for me to say anything smart about what the hell even just happened. Just easier for me to get it all out here. And I need to talk. Even if you jerks are off doing whatever. 
None of us asked for any of this. It didn't happen to us because we're, like, special. You can work as hard as you want, but the universe is gonna keep doing what it does. And I don't think any of us deserved all this. This is all stuff that started long before we were born. It's all like moving so fast and you're dropped into it and you're just trying to grab onto something. All of you are what kept me from floating off tonight. Also, you kind of killed that guy to save me. Don't think I didn't appreciate that. L O L. Yeah. I don't know if I'm ever going to understand what all just happened. I hope, I hope it stops. I just feel, right now, like all I want to do is wrap my arms around all of you. Not just because I love you, but to keep you all together with me. Wrap up into a ball and no one can hurt us. Sorry, I'm rambling. Germ, buddy. Germ, you don't even use Messenger. I guess I'm just <laughs> typing at you wherever you're at. I exist. But you're, he exists in the metaverse. You're definitely something. I'm so sorry about all you've gone through. I don't even understand all of your problems, but if I could, I'd fix them. I'd fix all of it. And I'd buy the tools to do it from your store. Or, like, borrow them, at least. A better friend would buy, but I'm what you got. And I'm glad. Yep, there it is. Now I'm just gonna erase all that. Oh, shit. No. Uh, guys, I was just kidding about a lot of that. I'm really tired. I don't know what, I, what I'm what i saying. Log off, May. Log off. Oh, we're not quite done. So also, awesome. what the fuck? <laughs> It was all a dream. Ah, yes. Void. Save. Check the save. Maybe it's open because of that ordeal. I need charcoal. <laughs> Weather service. Snow charcoal. in the forecast. Are you ready for what's coming your way? No. <laughs> I'm, I'm done with the weather. Hey, Mayor. You okay this morning? Not poo opening the pickaxe today. Greg informs me we're doing band practice, so I'll see you there. Hey, man. Nice messages last night. I mean, like, really? You massive dork. LOL. Band practice today! Because I feel like we need to do something normal. I'm at the Snalkin. Hope you're feeling okay. Sincerely, Gregory. Boy. Away message. It's good to be alive this morning. That's all. <laughs> and charcoal. Charcoal. And charcoal. Man of the hour. The epilogue. Stars. Check the safe. God. Check the safe. It's us. It's just unlock it. us, home and us. I don't know what this feeling is, but I'm not gonna cry today. Can I check the safe? Is that a thing yeah. that I can do? Yeah, better be. At the very end. Hmm, gotta be open. You must have missed something. Oh. That's right. Do we have to have Greg over? Maybe. I definitely feel there's some stuff we missed. But that's okay. Probably. There's like different routes you can take. Mm -hmm. Um like if you have a theme more you get a route oh, right. you get a route. Oh, uh, okay. If you wanna talk. Hi, sweetie. Hey, mom. How are you feeling? Good enough to jump up here. Can you do me a favor and stay home tonight? Uh, uh why? It's been, I just, uh, you're an adult. And you can do whatever you want. 
but you do live here. And you are still my baby. Aw, oh, Mom. We need to come up with some ground rules. Just because... Honey, you could have died the other night. And then you just left to hang out with your friends? I... She doesn't know what happened last night. I... I'm so sorry, Mom. Sweetie, what is going on with you? Uh... I don't even know if I can tell you. Why? I understand. I pro I promise. I don't even know how to talk about it yet, I don't think. What happened at school, hon? I don't care what it is. Just please, tell me. Are you working today? No, me and your father are both off today. I'll be around tonight. We can talk about it then. Sure. We can make breakfast for dinner like we used to. Dad can flip the pancakes in the air. Haha, <laughs> sure. Are you going out today? Yeah. Can you please stay in town? Close? Yeah, Mom. I think they're getting some of the longest night decorations out. Oh, wow. Calling it for some snow, too. That went fast. What did? The fall. Always does, son. Okay, well, I'm off. I love you, sweetie. I love you too, Mom. Hey, Dad. No work today? I told Bob to shove it. Really? No. <laughs> That's a dad joke. You, you okay? <laughs> yeah, I'll be fine. Not gonna sugarcoat it. I hate my job. Oh, Dad, why? I've mined, I've made glass, I've done a heap of other stuff. But this place, they just don't respect you for working. They don't? Job's supposed to pay you enough to live. Job's supposed to let you provide for your family. Job's supposed to have regular hours. Boss's supposed to respect you. Worker's supposed to be able to talk. Worker's supposed to be able to have a life. Worker's supposed to be able to live. Your mom always had to work, but... I wanted to give you and her your time. I wanted her to have hobbies. And enough time and money to do them. That's what made me happy. Now I just work so I can keep our health insurance. And hold on to the house. Try to, at least. Is there anything you can do? I mean, we do need a union. It's just easier to say than get it done. Unions were always there in the mines and the factory. At least for a while. But here... Listen, I'm, I'm gonna be around for dinner tonight. Wow, what's the occasion? Oh, well, Mom said we can make breakfast. Oh, sounds good. I was gonna talk about some stuff. Okay. Maybe we can talk about your stuff too? Just one big, uh, stu stuff session? That sounds great, kitten. Love you, Dad. Love you too. Be back later. It's got more dialogue. Well, what are you doing out here, by the way? Getting an early start on our longest night lights plan. Gotta dig them out of the closet. See if they even work still. Can I help to put them up? We'll see. You're a small fry. Dad. Dum de dum. I'm a dad. I'm standing here. I'm good. <laughs> Hey, what are you doing here? I'm working, May. Sure. <sighs> well, that's wrong. Don't ask. A lot of weird calls this morning. Oh. Well, uh, well what kind of calls? Mm. Question. You haven't seen... Never mind. Go do whatever it is you do. Okay, fine, I will. May. Spit it out already! Be careful. Just... Be careful. Well, jeez, until now I never considered that. 
May. Okay, fine. Thanks. Bye. Summers. Ah. What's up, Summers? You okay? After the whole like head injury thing? Yeah, I'm all right. Headache is all. Got some migraine stuff, man. If you need it. Yeah, it's not a migraine. Those things make me have to pee. It's the caffeine. Oh, if you ever take pills that make you pee, it's the caffeine. I didn't know that. You used to work at a pharmacy. Oh, right. Well, if I ever have a headache or need to pee, I'll come by. Anytime, neighbor. Okay, bye, Summers. Summers, where's my poem? <laughs> the amount of rock salt isn't the problem! I have enough damn trucks for this thing. Car slipping up all and down this goddamn hill, Colleen! I have tempted to just close the road when the storm hits. Oh yeah, good. Let's just give up. It's not giving up, Colleen. I'm sick of you undermining me. Oh, undermining. That's a bad oh, idea. Uh, That's not undermining. Ooh. It's Too undermining. Soon. I'm on Colleen's side on this one. Well, that's just great. That's just peachy pie, ain't it? Okay, fine, we'll close all, all the, the roads. roads. Don't close Let's the roads. Close road. down the whole damn town. Your ideas are always the most important. And the most thought out. What the? What the? Can I do another water balloon toss? I nearly froze to death last time. I still have the sniffles. I think we can all agree it's too cold for water balloons. Yeah, Kathleen, too cold for another stupid idea. Go to hell, Colleen. <laughs> oh my god. We could just hire some private plows. If you want to go against the DOT union, go right ahead. We got agreements with the county and state. Colleen's right on this one, too! If you agree... Oh. Sorry. If you two agree so much, why don't you just get married already? Ugh. You're so mean to me. <laughs> I'd rather die! I'd rather break my own femurs with a cinder block. <laughs> Alright, well, now that's settled, what are we gonna do about the road? Break for food? Great idea! I'm starving. Alright, this was enlightening. Still, we could still- we could still make decisions. Well, that was... Ha ha ha! Move out, troops! That was enlightening. Goodbye Don't now. order- do not order me around. I didn't serve 13 years in the Navy to be ordered around by my fellow councilmen. Mm -hmm. But you could. Oh, hey, Miss Mirza. Oh, hello, mate. Fe feeling better? As well as to be expected, I suppose. Yeah, it's good. Do you want to talk about your grandfather? Yeah. Possible Springs was built on our backs and the backs before us. Time was they didn't. Time was they didn't repay the people any real money. Paid in little tokens and bills stamped with the company name. Good at the company store for company goods. Back in school, they showed us some of those weird quarters and stuff. Your grandfather remembered. His daddy experienced it firsthand. Mine boss came into town driving a big fancy car. I, I met your grandfather. A real bastard, that boss. God forgive him. 
Your grandfather runs out of the dance. I think he was a bit drunk or just stupid in some brave way. He shouts, the guts of all bosses. He all of a sudden has a hunting knife from somewhere. And he slashes the boss's tires. <laughs> wow. Picks up a rock, put it through the windshield, then he climbs up. I'm sorry, this part is a bit rude. Holy shit, don't stop. <laughs> he pees through the windshield hole. This is amazing. Did they catch him? No, just me and a few other folks saw it. I trot over to him and we run off down the alley. Past the AOK -okay drugstore. Big field, big parking lot nowadays. Stars fat and bright. I guess we were both pretty drunk. One thing led to another. Oh, okay. Wait, what is this? A uh, very, very long time ago. Let's see. So what happened with the car? <laughs> got, got towed away. Police couldn't get no witnesses. Who would snitches about that kind of thing? Damn right. So, so like I said, got troublemaker blood. <laughs> Jeez, I never knew this. I don't think your daddy even knows. I bet not. You gonna tell him? <laughs> yes. <laughs> no. Secret keeper like me, eh? I just think it'd be a weird conversation. You may find someday it isn't so strange. I wanted to pass this story along to you. It was one night, one thing he did. In a lifetime of nights and things he did. What you want to do with that is part of your story now. I can't talk much more for today. I'd like to know more about him. This was crazy. I'll see you, May. Sooner or later. Okay. Bye, Miss Rosa. Bye for now, May Borowski. Oh, it's the, the kids. The brand hey, you guys. Oh. Yeah. Stay safe, alright? Well, thanks, Mom. Are you our new mom? Apparently. Life man, it, it goes. Holy. Nah, dude. Nah. She's weird. Wait, mom, we, we need to pick us up from practice. <sighs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's go to the Snalkin. The Snalkin. Well, 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 look who's alive and well. Is that a surprise? Nah. Just seems like... Relevant. Well, look who's alive and well, you too. Yeah. Yeah. You wanna get out of here? Do band practice? Yeah. God, this door just does not like to open. I bet it's worse in the summer. So, did you get all your... Did you all get keys to the back door? Greg got one and we made copies. How do you even get a key? I have no idea. Where's Greg? I had to spring Angus from work. What does that mean? Zero clue. I'm a little unclear about how both of them still have jobs, since they seem to just up and leave work early a lot. There's a lot about those two I do not understand. I think they just plain need each other. Greg, more than Angus, I think. I don't think Angus would agree. That's because it wouldn't occur to Angus to think otherwise. Because Angus is an extremely nice person. Do, uh, do you not think they'll last or something? I mean, they're high school sweethearts. Once they move and change, and meet new people, and become new people, I think Angus is gonna find he's got more options. 
He just thinks Greg, like, saved him. Listen, I'm not saying he didn't if he thinks so. Angus might also just be attracted to really sincere guys in leather jackets. Who carry knives. I mean, if I met the right guy, those would all be pluses. Jeez, you thought this out. Before you came back, they were the only people I hung out with most of the time. I've had a lot of time to study. So like, how are you? I don't even know. I'm still processing. I'm here though. Yeah. You? Um, not great. I had a dream the world was ending. Might be. You think we're safe? No idea. Great feeling. Great feeling. Yep. Oh, sorry. So, like, I'm a little confused what even happened last night. Uh, the whole cosmic horror thing? <laughs> well, the, there's apparently a death cult of dads, or was. Who knows if that was all of them. I can't believe they even exist, or existed. Probably take them a few days to die. Yep. No, I kind of understand them in a weird way. Really? It's like a porch light that's on, and there are all these bugs around it, and then the light goes out. There's a hole where the light was. It's like what happened to me way back. Like I was telling you about on the couch last night. Holy crap, that was last night. Seems like two lifetimes ago. <laughs> yeah. The world is extremely bad. Yes. Yes, it is. Weird question. How do you, like, get up every day and go open the store and keep doing it? I don't really have a choice, do I? I guess not. But, but still, lo lots of people would be like, destroyed by what you've been through. My mom was extremely tough and smart. Oh. When I found out she was gonna die, it just didn't occur to me that she was fragile. Like, we're all fragile. I don't want to let her down, I guess. I can't not give a shit. I mean, I do the store, and our bills at home. Stuff with the Chamber of Commerce, doing free study courses online, and I'm a member of the Young Socialists. I sleep a lot and sometimes eat pizza. Each according to their ability. Well, on the bright side, you got me! <laughs> yeah. We can fix the world together. Yep, fix it right up. I guess last night wasn't so weird. It was pretty weird. Old men killing the youngs and the poors. To get back some past that barely existed. Samuel Samuel. They're like ghosts in some old mansion. Killing the new owners. Makes me want to either give up or try harder. Or get really upset and take a nap. Yeah, naps fix everything. <laughs> or like drop an elevator on them. That works too, I guess. I get it to you, got me there. So, have you had any new, uh, r rat problems at the shop? Uh, yeah, how did you know? I heard there were some rats around town. Makes me happy for some reason. Well, there's no such thing as a small rat problem. There's just gonna be more of them. Hope springs. Rats multiply. Cute. We literally saw rat poos. They're going down. We'll see. Hey, speaking of nothing, uh, how, how good is your car? Good how? Like, can it drive real far? Mate, do you know anything about... What? We should, like, do a road trip. Go where? Out west. Gets all flat. What did it do? We can go where it's really flat, and they and you can see, like, the world's largest pierogi. Or a museum of, of toy rocket ships, or a factory where they make pretzels, or a house that looks like a big chicken. I could 
Okay, let's talk about it next year. I'll start planning it now. I thought you couldn't leave home because of your issue. Yeah, you're home enough. Maybe if we're trapped here together, might as well be trapped out there together. Maybe if we're not dead by then, lol. You have a way of making Doom sound like a lot of fun, Mayday. That's actually kind of a gift. And... Greg... God damn this door! I think God already has. There they are. <laughs> hey guys. Sup, nerds? How did you get Angus out of work? I made up a family emergency. My uncle got run over by a tractor. Oh, uh, wow. I mean, he did in real life, too, but that was years ago. Sorry. Um, no, hey, Greg, okay. so... I didn't really know Casey. Yeah. I just wanted to say I'm really sorry. Yeah. Thanks. Casey was a good one. Casey was good. Should we, like, tell his parents? Uh, no? I mean, tell them what? Uh, yeah. Hmm. Good point. So, like, what do we, what do, we do? About Casey? No, like, in general. Can we think about this tomorrow? Can we just play a song and get a pizza? I don't think song and pizza is an answer, really. Can we just be normal for, like, one day? I don't know how today can possibly feel normal. When I, when I was down there last night, I, like, made the decision not to die, or at least not to die without a fight, and the thing down there told me nothing would save me forever. Wait, it was, like, talking to you? It's been talking to me for a long time. I just didn't know, didn't know what it was. But anyway, like, nothing is gonna save us forever. A lot of things can save us today. It's really pretty, May. Ah, oh, thanks. I totally made it up. Like, right on the spot last night. I said it before. You're good with Doom. Doom, dum, 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 dum. So anyway, song and pizza. We earned it by still being alive for another day. That's a decent reason. Decent. 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 That's it. That's the game. This is the game. That was a lot. That was a lot. That was a lot to do the last night. That was a lot to do the last night. Yeah. So basically that cult was like the League of Shadows from Batman, where they just come out once in a while and just like ruin a couple things. And it's like, okay, back to normal. But like, what is the thing in the hole? Is it just like Eldritch Deity? Is it just... Yes. Huh. I think it's just a bigger hole in a mine. It's just a pit. No, it's not just a pit. There's it's no bottom. What do you mean there's no bottom? It has to end. Where no. does it go? It, the, the guys literally said, somebody fell into the hole and never hit the bottom, and something else talked out of it. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, it's fucked. It was a good game, though. Like, it was good. It was really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very well written. <laughs> Definitely handles mental Ill illness in a good in a very good way yeah yes and the music's great mm -hmm. yeah all right i will watch i will watch the credits but i'm going to end the stream okay i'm gonna go to bed until next time everybody good night everybody good night, good night. Good night. Good night.